What's going on, everybody? This is Al from NCAA 06 Revival. And in the last game, we played Georgia. Played it between the hedges, and we had a pretty good victory, 144-22. And now we have a tune-up game against Louisiana Monroe before we head back into the SEC schedule. Before we play them, let's do some prep work. Let's go to NCAA's recruiting. If I'm not mistaken... We may have a couple guys visit this week. Let's look at Rashad Kane. We're still good with him. Steve Arnold, he's visiting, quarterback. Let's see. Uh, he doesn't care about coach prestige. He doesn't care about location, nor playing early. So we'll just go program prestige. That's always a safe bet. And the other quarterback we're going after, Ryan Sears. Let's have both of them come. I don't know if that will conflict things or not. I don't think this game uh, handles uh, having two quarterbacks visiting the same week. I don't think that makes any difference. Let's see. Location, not much of a factor. Okay, we'll just do program prestige for him. I did get a question on YouTube a while back asking me why am I going after pocket passers when I'm doing a spread offense. But if you remember, this dynasty is all about just – getting the best players I could find and then tailoring my offense to them and not the other way around. So uh, there's a very good chance either Sears or Arnold uh, will be my starting quarterback next season. So who knows what the offense will look like. Just got to play it by ear. Okay, and center, Rod Holloway. I'm going to have everybody come. The sooner the better when it comes to visits. That's always uh, the plan that I've always stuck with, and it's worked out pretty well for me. Not concerned about academics. We'll just go with program prestige. And middle linebacker. Oh, I'm so close to getting him to visit. But we're still good there, but don't know anything about him. What he likes, what he doesn't like. So we got three guys coming in for visits. Two quarterbacks in the center. Should be interesting. Let's go to Sports Illustrated real quick. Check out the polls and all that other good stuff. Of course, we're number one in the country. I want to go to the Heisman Watch. I'm pretty sure Hatchell, still top of the list. I think he can win it this year. Just got to keep feeding him the ball and getting a bunch of touchdowns. The guy behind him doesn't have as many t touchdowns and nowhere near as many yards. So we should be good there. Purdue, they're lighting it up through the air as usual. Uh, let's go to conference standings. LSU, they're playing pretty good. They're moving back up. Ole Miss, they're undefeated in the conference. There's just a ton of football left to be played. Players of the week, I never really look at this. I never show you guys. Uh, of course, last week, Hatchell, top offensive player. Let's just run down through these weeks here. See if we got anybody else. No, it was just week six when Hatchell just had just an incredible game. Gave him the ball a ton, four touchdowns. He done it all. All righty, let's look at Louisiana Monroe. They're just hodgepodge average. I think they're a Sun Belt team, if I'm not mistaken. Of course, look at our stats. We're as good as you can ask for in this game. I'm trying to think of any years in the past where I've had better stats than that team-wise and – Oh, gosh, I can't think of any. So, needless to say, the dynasty is going well. I shouldn't have any discipline issues. Yep. I've pretty much locked down all the discipline stuff. Quarterback receive. Yeah, we'll just see who the Rampack players are. I'm pretty sure they're a spread team. If I'm not mistaken, I've played with them before, way back in the day. And I think they're in the gun more often than not. We'll find out. Got a tackle that's out, probably a starter. Pretty day for football. Let's take care of business and maybe get some recruits to commit. Coin toss, yes, I want to receive. Let's check out their roster. Very good quarterback. Wow, best quarterback in their conference easily. 
But he's slow, which means I can go after him pretty hard via the rush. Pass rush. Uh, halfbacks, Robbie Rivas. My guess they'll probably give him the ball as many times as possible. He's not the fastest guy in the world, but he's pretty strong. So, full, They got a good fullback. Receivers, man, they got a pretty good little team. 85-80. I mean, for Sunbelt, 80 at tight end, but he's very slow and he can't catch. So, he's just a blocking tight end. Yeah, their top, yeah, their left tackle's out. The guy behind him, both of them are 68. And 80, 72, 76, 68. It's it's uncanny. Offensive line is what makes or breaks a lot of teams, what makes them different from the rest. Their offensive line is just beyond, I mean, below average. Your mind is superb. If you got a good offensive line, you can do pretty good things, needless to say. Okay, defense 74, 78, 78, 80. Just a pretty good little defensive line for, for them. Uh, 76, 80, and 65 for... They're linebackers, so they're outside linebacker. That right outside linebacker, I need to go after him some if I can. But they're pretty good. Uh, corner, 74, 72. Here's where I could probably exploit them. They got a true freshman start for them on the right side. Let's see if I can go after him, if I can remember to do that. 78 and 76 for safeties. So they just got an average defense, but actually pretty good for who they are. Let's see if they got any decent kickers. 70 and 70. No. Bunch of young guys. Alrighty. I'm just going to keep doing my normal stuff. I should just overpower them. Hopefully, I just won't have any injuries today. Blow them out. And uh, impress the recruits that are visiting. Let's take this sucker out. There we go. Might have some room here. Good drive there. Good. You're right. Start. Let's just nice start with a, a P.E. Reed out of spread. Yep. And a few more of those oh, they're going to run that three or the four-two-five defense. Okay, they're going zone. Going yeah, cover two. Throws this one out to the nice. Right. Down the we went cover two, zone. Just go to your cover two beater. I'm going to stay over here. Let's go after that corner again. We're going to make him pay. Let's go to a screen. Central Florida has just been going zone. Got offense. the top offense so in the country. So they got themselves in the top ten in the country all year long. These guys have been almost impossible. To Pick up about seven yards. A seven-yard pickup on the screen play. Now let's run a basic speed option. These red zone stats going man. Tell how good a team handles the pressure when they've got a short. We're shifting that they way, so. They seem to score every no, that's not going to help me. Oops. Well, apparently Hanchel was going to the right and I was going to the left. I must not have hot rat of the run to the left, but that's okay. We still got the six. TG13. All right, perfect drive to start the game. Let's go play some defense and see what they could do against us. Get the extra point here. Perfect kick. And he hits the PAT. And now we'll take Pretty day for football. Drive 21 seconds. Didn't take too long. Everyone's all Let's get a decent kick here. Not too bad. Kicks it deep. Yep, definitely going to be a touchback. McDaniel fields it in the end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to We're going to go you four know. wide. This is what I expected. Let's just do quarters out of 4-3. Get my best 11 out there. I need to run a little 4 4 because my backup middle linebacker is pretty stout too. But. All right, let's see what they do to us here. Oh, draw. There we go. Good reaction there. Four, three. Let's do a uh, blitz now. Going out of the gun. Like I said, I think they'll go out of the gun the entire game. Just a bad throw. You got to keep it under control. Tight end was That's fairly nice open. He just break, but it overthrew him just a little bit. Okay. Let's just run basic cloud. Right, Third and long. That's what we want. Nickel defense. Make good decisions here. Maybe our front four can get some pressure. 
That's a good throw. That's just a good defense right there about the corner. That's why you want tall corners. They get their paw on it. All right, they're going to punt. Maybe McDowell can get a big play here. They line up to punt this one away. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. McDowell uh, takes uh, it to 28. Uh, Probably should have fair caught that, but that's okay. The first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well. On Let's their last go. Position. On their way to the end zone. Trips over, spread, five wide. Let's put Hatchell there. Let's do zig outs. They'll get the ball here. I haven't ran this play all the season. They're going zone. I could do the hatch across the middle. I'll just play it safe. Up in the gun. He drops back. Look. Throws this one Ooh, the that right. could have been intercepted. I know the mm. pass was fired pretty hard, but you still have to catch it. That's right. The only reason is out That could have been bad. That's okay. We survived that. But okay, they're going down. We'll just run basic speed option. They're going that way. Let's just run to the left. They'll run the option. Yeah, just don't do anything crazy. Just get the first. Pick up the first down. And that was just good instinct. You have to know when to pitch it. Now let's give it to Gaines. Let's do a screen to the left. Going. So man, I'm just going to head and just throw it to him. I could go over the top. Yeah, I could go over the top. Ah, ah. Edge the bad throw. Got bogged down. Let's do P.A. Reed at a normal. The going dime. Man. I may just run here, give the hatch over. Yep. That was the right decision. Oh, crap. Why did I juke? I still might get the touchdown. Oh, I shouldn't have juked. I don't know what, why I done that. Should, I, yeah, that was a waste of a juke there. Probably could have scored if I didn't have done that. That's okay. Okay, where am I at here? I'm on the 17. Let's get fancy here. Let's go here. Let's do halfback circle. The pressure They're going man. In the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone. When We've seen this play one, before. Matt going to cover one. He's looking. He's going Good left. throw. Good catch. First down. down. Like now I'm within the five-yard line, so I'm, yeah, I'm on the two. The so let's just right. run our basic toss. The offense just executed, and the result is the first Going down. zone. I'll just run to the left. Central Florida comes out with two tight ends. Ooh, whoa, okay. <laughs> For some reason, the, my pitch button didn't work. So I guess TG13 was going to score. <laughs> my R2 button was stuck or something. All righty. Two quick scores. First quarter ain't even halfway over with. Point. Looks like I'll definitely put in my sub second half. And remember the good folks at Pontiac have been bringing you fuel for the soul since trying to think who hasn't touched the ball yet. All my main studs who normally do have already touched it. Sends it sailing downfield. Pretty good kick. He's going to take it out though. Rebus. Fields it in the end zone. Good stop there. Offense takes over, and the last time they had the ball. I'm going to blitz again. They got a tight end on the line, so we're going trips over. I'm going to go up the middle here, see if one of my guys can, on the left, can penetrate here. Nope. Ooh, sack anyways. Big James Van, the senior. Okay, going for, let's do quarters. Got a top defense in the country. Top offense, just the best team. Without a doubt. Intercept that. Ooh, that's close. Let's see, third and 17. We'll just go cloud. Well, that window must have been tinted because he almost threw a pick. The Indian come out the shotgun. Going trips on me again. See, their slot guy can't hear the call. Woo! Got a hand on it there. And they're going to punt. There was no one open. He threw it in there anyway. They line up to punt this one away. See if McDowell can maybe make a play here. It's 
off, and it is a dandy. Let's see, I'll probably just take it to the left. McDowell fields it at the 42. Block. Ah, oh, that's a good little return. And now we'll see the offense come out out of the field for their next possession. Let's do some triple. Out of slot. Going on the good field position. Man. Here. I'll probably oh, just keep it here. here. Gonzalez running the option. And now he pitches it. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have pitched it. Should have kept it. Still got the first. Didn't really matter, I guess. Ooh, and Hatch was hurt. Injured his head. Hopefully it's not too serious. Okay, I'm on the 24. Let's go. I don't know. Maybe too far away, but I'm going to try to get a touchdown here. We're going zone. Let's see if I can get this to McDowell here. On the gun. They'll throw on first down. Across the middle. And Good throw. Good catch. Way to look it in. Now I'm on the yeah, what? Sure was. Five. He's played some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. Let's just run speed right. option. Now they're the going to go line. Let's have a look at the number. That's okay. I'll Old just attempt it. Win for just run right here. here. Option to the right. Now he pitches it. Tries there we to go. Juke. Just get the touchdown. touchdown. For Osei. Osei, can you see? And with that touchdown, it's not working good. Yo, someone slow these guys down. Someone Let's just hope Hatchell isn't hurt too badly. Hate to lose an impact player. And he hits the PAT. Less than two to go in our first quarter. All right, let's go back and play some defense. Wow, well, first quarter still not over with. Louisiana Monroe, nothing. Central Florida, ready to kick this one I could beat this team by 100 if I wanted to. Not going to, though, there's no need. He kicks it. See, that should be a touchback. Oh, he's going to take this out. McDaniel fields it in the end zone. Still great coverage. You guys remember what this offense did the last time they had the ball? Going three wide. Let's try another blitz. Now for the game, that's okay. It could be worse. The Indian come out showing three wide. Go in the B gap here. No, to the air on first down. That's a good throw. Picked up a few yards. I'm going to keep blitzing. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. They shift on their defensive front. Going under center this time. Going under the ace slot. Love that formation. He drops back. Oh, just couldn't get to him in time. Good defense by the safety. Just got a hand on it. decision to throw it into such tight coverage. Five wide. Let's just go back to Cloud. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 18. Louisiana Monroe comes out in the shotgun. Got some talent all over the place. Steps up. Look. Uh oh, here we go. I didn't press any button. I just got in front of the ball and let the computer take care of the rest. Okay, moment 18. Let's go. We're going to have to stage some sort of comeback in the second half. I'm going to attempt to play. I don't usually do it a whole lot because I'm going to do a PA corner out of slot. They'll go to work at the 18. If I get decent blocking, Gonzalez is back in the gun. Might be able to Gonzalez. get. Bill has it. Across the middle. Oh, the just threw it too hard, too low. He was wide open. Should have put a little more touch that on it. That's okay. That was a beautiful play. Let's go here. Let's run basic trips or a QB choice. The pressure turns up when going in the red zone. zone. And that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Gonzalez is in the zone and looking to make a play. Look at all that block. Easy peasy. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort and there. And the four, let's just go back to our typical guy. toss. Get in the end zone. They're going zone. We'll just run to the left. They come out with a big set. Good block. Touchdown, Six Central points. Florida. Oh, my, when it rains, it pours. And the quarter's still not over with. My goodness. <laughs> May put in my second string in the second quarter. And he tacks on the extra point. We're just over a minute to go in the first quarter. Let's go back and play some defense. 
Hopefully this game will convince all three of those guys to come in. That'd be awesome. Get those two big time quarterbacks. That big center. McDaniel fields it in the end zone. Let's watch this defense and how aggressive they are. Build my offense around those guys. Uh, they're going five wide, so let's just do quarters out of nickel. I need to do it at 3-4 against that. That's what I need to do. Hey, that's right, sweetheart. I'm always excited. They'll throw on first down. Oh, I still got the catch. Well, coach, a short pickup on that pass. Play. Okay, let's go. You know what? Okay. As long as they've we'll do cores out of three. three. I think maybe out of four and five wide, I might go to my three four. Who are trying to hold their block. Just experiment with it some. Reba on the handoff. Smith with a yeah, takedown. Might have picked up a yard Running there. Back. It's two on the carry. Going three wide. I'll just do quarters again. Louisiana Monroe. Is ranked I'm gonna bring everybody up this time, though. As far as offense goes. Well, the numbers don't lie. They just can't move the ball. I think they may just run it here. They go with the option. The coach can't like this. Oh, good. No, oh, man, I over pursued on that one badly. And they push him That's out. a good run. I thought he was going to get caught in the backfield, and I cut too early. The guys up front, and they are really starting to work hard in the trenches. Let me tell you something. The biggest compliment you've got 251 yards in the, the first hard. quarter. And you're Golly. Right. These guys are playing real hard right now. Going to draw. There we go. What a hit. Bowling with a clothesline. Okay, let's do 3 4. Let's do quarters out of this. Since we're going four Second wide. Ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. There we go. Yeah, that looks pretty good. In a four wide let's see if my front three can do damage. They snap it to the back. Good. He's got good pursuit there by Bowling. And that was a good stop by the defense. They got him in the Just let the quarter run out. All right, that was a flawless quarter, if there ever was one. Going five wide. Go. I'll just stick with quarters out of three, four. Central Florida, 28. Louisiana Monroe, nothing. The defensive back's moving in closer. Nelson set to go to the air. Down the middle. Good throw, good catch. Just not enough for the first. They're going to punt. Ooh, I probably should have. Probably shouldn't have done the punt return. I should have done the field goal block. Get everybody out of the way. Hopefully McDowell won't mess this up. Hangs it up high. McDowell. Just fair catch that get everybody out of the way. There we go. Just get in the end zone. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next position. Let's do a screen. They'll start this drive. Go to Mendoza. Hurry up to the line here. Central Florida. Lines up in the shotgun set. Throws and they've got the screen set. There we go. Eh, bogged him down a little bit, but I still got a huge gain. Down the sideline. Big He's play right there, big play. To the 44-yard line. Great call. You got to love the screen pass. Gert, Let's run a basic curls with an outside zig. Going man. Of the time, the ball I bet that safety's coming down to McDowell. Yeah, I'll, I'll just give this to Gaines. This, you can peel a blocker back. However, it doesn't matter what direction you attack from. If you've already Gone the first down, to the house. And Six points. Score. Just a perfect throw. If you can make the perfect throw, your wide receiver should be able to get enough separation. To just keep on going. And I actually threw it a tad late. And it helps at the corner trying to go for the ball with a dive, and that just didn't work. All right. Another touchdown. Get the extra point here. The back and play some defense. And remember, the good folks at Pontiac have been bringing you fuel for the soul since 1926. Central Florida lines up for the kickoff. Reba and McDaniel. Not the best kick in the world, but that should stay in bounds. Yeah, he's going to return it. McDaniel fields it at the two. Brought it out to about the 30. The offense comes back on the field, hoping to build off their last drive. It's all about execution, my friends. We saw them move the football, but they were unable to move it. Let's go here. Let's see if I can get to this guy. Maybe we'll go play action. They tightened up when they had to, and they're going to look to do the same here. Too easy. Billy Hill, he's just too fast. Yeah, the linebacker shot through, and nobody picked him up. Run the same play. He wasn't letting the quarterback get anywhere. 
Second down, 14 coming up here. I'm going to go Ball on right the 26-yard line. Make that tackle work. There we go. And he stopped behind the line. He went off tackle. They went right to the blitz side. It's going with five wide. Let's just do quarters at a 3-4. Third down and a couple miles here. Ball on the 23-yard line. Drops back to back. Steps up in the pocket. He's working. He gets the pass Just too, too much pressure. Brings up the punting situation. I'll tell you too what, much pressure. All right, let's go back and get back on offense. Maybe McDowell can get a breakaway here. The Indians are lining up the punt it away. It's Ooh, he could have blocked that. Why he didn't? Get a hand up on that one. McDowell fields it at the 34. A little bit of a game there, not a whole lot. The action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. Go uh, QB draw at a five wide. Yeah, that probably wasn't a good idea. Yeah, it's not a whole lot there. So the quarterback keeper gets maybe. That's great against dime, not so much against four two five. Uh, let's go here. Let's do uh, some second and nine coming up. Smash Ball on the switch. They're going zone. Let's get it. Red six six man protection. Four wide set. Gonzalez drops back. Looking. He rolls left. He wants it all going long. Good throw. Right where I needed to be. That was my cover two beater. I had all time to roll to throw. Now I'm on the 25. Let's do another rollout. Let's do halfback streak. They're going zone. Now they're going down. They'll bring in their dime back. Going cover two. He's rolling right. Going deep. Perfect throw. Right over the shoulder. Oh my gosh. PG 13. Having the game of his life. Look at this throw. He didn't even have to turn around. It was just like. Didn't even have to turn the hips. Just right over the shoulder. Golly. I bet TG 13's. Ratings are just through the roof. Look at that. 98 overall. He's just having the perfect game. There's no way around it. We'll definitely have to check the stats at halftime because I'm taking them out thin. Hopefully this game didn't hurt Hatchell's chances of the Heisman. Definitely helped TG 13s, that's for sure. But with a quarterback to win the Heisman, you got to get a ton of touchdowns. I mean, that's the secret to winning the Heisman is just touchdowns. And then yards. But usually one follows the other. Let's see, he'll definitely McDaniel return this one. The two. They didn't even Not get to the 30. On their last drive. Going they five wide, let's do quarters out of three, four again. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. One, Going with the three. shotgun here. Ooh, almost got an intercept. He's asking to get picked off. Got a hand on it. Right. Going four if wide. We'll no step in quarters again. Nothing wrong with tucking it in and trying to pick up the first on the ground. Louisiana Monroe lines up in a Just shotgun. Get everybody set. back there. He drops back. He steps up. He'll dump this one. He's running the zig, but I slowed him down a little bit. I don't know too many seven foot guys play football, nickel. so maybe he should aim Let's lower the playoff. next time. Third, third, third and long. This is what we always want. They shift on the defensive line. Let's do this now. Let's go. Pump up the crowd. Make a play. Oh, good catch. Going up against a young corner, and that's a good catch. He didn't get a hand up or anything. It's not bad. All right, let's first and ten. run our blitz. The impact player at running back is I'll go around the, the edge right here now. this time. And they make the stop. Picked up a few yards. Picks up about three on the draw. Let's run the same blitz. 
and second down and seven to go. And this Keep is going after this guy. The current drive. Rebound. Going under center. Is in the zone. play action. To make something happen. I went right after the quarterback. <laughs> he fooled me a little. Uh, let's let's just do quarters since it's the third down. This third down I'm short. I'm thinking they may run it, drive. so we'll just get everybody up on the line. There we go. It's a great stop there. I'm glad I went over the on the edge on the field goal. Makes no sense, but it worked. their bodies in there and stuffed them. It looks like they're going to try for the long first half is close to being over. Still got another. They're going to run out a little clock here. Still, I'll have about a minute to work with. Try to get down the field and score again, which is what I'll try to do. So I'll have a one-minute offense. Just let TG 13 keep slinging it. Miss it, miss it. Ooh, barely got it. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. All right, a minute eight. I'm just going to throw it all down the field and see if we can score another touchdown before we put in the second string. Yeah, it's not a whole lot there. Let's see, I'm on the right hash. Let's go here. Let's do a deep attack. Choice, they're going zone, dime. Central Florida sets up with four receivers. Back to pass. He's looking. Across the middle. I got and another hand. Ooh, I got so lucky. It's just good I just threw a little too hard. I should have put just a little more touch on it. All reaction. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length away. Those are one of the harder passes to throw, but if you get the right touch on it, it looks awful pretty. All right, they're going man. Got a couple options here. We're going to cover one. Across the middle. Give it to Mendoza. Good throw there. I had to back up a little bit to avoid the sack. Now let's go to circle. They're going zone. Hurry up to the line here. I'm going to call a timeout. Picked up four. Let's go offensive line. Let's go. Let's do tight end delay. They're going man. Ball on the 40-yard line. Have several options here. Let's see who defends those Come out in the shotgun. He drops back. He throws it. He can't catch him. Complete. Let's just try to get out of bounds. Get the first. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily. Let's do halfback under. The wide receiver under. Going zone or halfback corner, I think is what it is. They're going zone. Let's see if I can give it to McDowell. The Golden Knight. Come out showing three wide. He's looking. Wide open. Great throw. Now that was a good looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it. Now let's run tight and cross. You've hardly ever seen me run this play. They're going man. Quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. Let's see what they do here. Run the gun. Back to pass. Looking. Down the middle. Ah, I threw it. Yeah, that was just great defense. Shouldn't have thrown it as hard as I did. Oh, well. Might be what they to get back Probably should just throw game. it to my go nice route. Try, well, let's look at that play. I, I should have lobbed it instead of throwing his bullet. He already had the, the inside. If McDowell had the inside, I probably could have scored a touchdown. So let's go to instant replay. Let's move this around. Let's, yeah, see, that defender had the inside the entire time. I should have went. I should have lobbed it. To Mendoza, lob it over to these two guys. He probably would have picked up the first, and we could have had more time to do stuff. But oh well, that's how you learn. If we're going five wide. Let's just go quarters out of three four. They'll take over. Well, that's it for TG13. I hate for him to end on an interception, but he don't need to be playing. None of the first stringers do. Nelson, back to throw. Watch the throw. Outside. Intercept that. Thank you. Fumble. Fumble. Picks up huh. Go ball and get a block. Oh. Eight seconds. Okay, I'm on the 20. Well, I guess it's TG3. <laughs> I guess he's going to go at least one more round. Another play. Uh, let's see. I'm, let's go here. Let's go back to circle. Going zone. If they go cover two, I'm going to try to thread the needle to Mendoza. 
We'll see if it works. Going to cover two. Whoop! Ah, love it. Perfect throw. Touchdown. Now he can go sit down. <laughs> what a throw. Just threading the needle. It went cover two, so I went to the cover two beater. I normally would do the rollout, but in this case, really didn't need to. Okay. Now let's, before I forget, let's go mass sub, second team. There we go. Oh, I'm glad he ended his game on a high note. We'll check out the stats here at halftime. Sammy touchdowns he can't afford. I think he counted for seven. I think every single touchdown was his except for, well, maybe Osei had one run, one rush for a touchdown. I'll definitely have to pay more attention to the Heisman watch now that I, it's possible I can get both Hatchell and TG13 on the list at the same time. And I got two seconds left. Gosh, this is the longest half ever. Let's just run quarters. Second half, I'll run clock and play around with some flex bone and run and shoot stuff. Going off tackle. Oh, tackle. Went right by me. Oh. Okay, let's check out the stats. The team stats, I mean, 400 yards of offense, one half. I mean, what can you say? I'm going to go to the individual stats. 14 of 18, 290 yards, three touchdowns, one interception. Rushing, he had two. He had five touchdowns, so good for him. Hatchell still leading the rushing, even though he got hurt in the first quarter. Receiving, Mendoza, Gaines, McDowell will say, Mendoza, 140 yards. He's just killing it today. And so on and so forth. Okay. Let's knock the rest of this game out. Central Florida got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. Looks like a decent kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. McDaniel fields it in the end zone. And I think my third string middle linebacker is pretty decent, too. I may be able to run a little more 3 4. Yeah, 88 overall. <laughs> Third string middle linebacker, 88 overall. Ridiculous. Look at that, two sophomores. Just recruiting. That's all it is. So let's run a ton of 3 4. Let's experiment with it. I'll do basic quarters for now. Nelson comes to the line with three wide. Nelson on first down. Woo almost intercepted. Almost picked so close. Way to keep your head on a swivel, kid. We'll stick that here. Let's try a blitz. Let's do a, uh, and knock it down let's do this crash, too. See sure how this... Coach. He put himself in great position to make a play. Louisiana Monroe comes to the line with three wide. Nelson with three wide receivers. Go to the outside here. I don't know if this will work or not. Oh, I forgot. I got a spy working there. Oh, gosh. What a throw. It's Good defense. Got a hand on it. The pass was knocked down. No pressure whatsoever. See, that worries me with a 3 4. It's just, making plays wish it'd be a little bit better. I like having four linemen going at him. Okay. They're going five wide. Uh oh. Six points to the house. Pick six. What is going on here, guys? And just big mistake, big mistake. Out there Anything and everything is going right Read that there. one like a book. There's not much else you can do except pack just it sit there and wait. Try again next week. Well, let's go back and play some defense. Extra point is good. Decent kick. That should stay in bounds. Yeah, he'll definitely return it. McDaniel fields it at the three. Good hit. 
This defense did a nice Jackson. job last time around, forcing the interception. And now you find going out how three. So let's try the. the let's do a thunder two. Let's we'll see what that does. It's first and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. The Indian come out in the ace formation. Sack. Oh, fumble. Pick it up. Jackson. Unreal. Oh, craziness. Great blitzing. Well, I'll have to go back and look at the replay on this one. Do some film study here. Let's turn this around. The tackle had to get either the defensive end or myself. And that left guard was responsible for picking me up. And I was just too quick. Fumble, sack, pick it up. Good to go. Okay. Let's run some triple out of flex bone. They're going to man. I'll just keep it simple and just if it's zone, give it to my B back. If not, just do the rest. So let's go here. Here's the option. He's got an open go right down. Late hit. Oh, so close. Just Put him on the six. I'm on the five. They'll probably, they'll probably go goal line. Yeah. I kind of had a bounce, though, so I'm going to have to. I think they're going man. Yeah. Let's go to the left. Touchdown. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Just. It's a good little toss. Well, let's go back and play some defense. I'm going to try to run as much clock as possible, but right now the <laughs> they won't let me. And he tacks on the extra point. Over four minutes remaining here in the third quarter. And the score back and play some defense. 63, Louisiana Monroe, three. Central Florida is ready to see if I can get away. a decent kick here. Not too bad. He'll probably return it. And he got all of this one. Great yep. kick. Coming McDaniel right up the gut. Fields it in the end zone. There we go. Jackson with another stop. My goodness. He's making use of his time today, that's for sure. Okay, they're going three, four. Or they're going four wild. Let's just go. Quarters out of three, four. Take it easy, coach. You're getting excited. Hey, that's right, sweetheart. I'm always excited. Jackson with another tackle. They get three yards on the play. I said they're going five wide. We'll just stick with basic quarters. Second and seven. Ball on the 28. The Indian come out in the shotgun. Let's punch up my line here and see if that makes any difference. Ooh, almost intercepted. Good defense there, guys. I wonder if the quarterback has got bodies all over the place. Uh, let's do a uh, let's do a thunder two. Normally don't want to blitz this much on third down, but I don't think it really matters at this point. Louisiana Monroe goes with the ace set here. Let's see if I can get to the outside here. Didn't even have a chance. My goodness. It's too quick. I know I haven't posted a video in the last few days, but I've actually been in practice mode a lot, just taking around with some stuff. I think in the previous video I told you I know my next dynasty will be with Kansas. Should be a lot of fun. And for the last several videos, I've mentioned the type of offense I'm going to run. It's either going to be flex bone or run and shoot. Well, I think I'm going to combine the two and just run like a triple shoot offense. If you guys have ever seen that before, uh, it does exist out there. It's based on a lot of flex bone formations, triple option with a lot of vertical stuff. We'll see how it works. Uh, I'm excited what I've seen so far. Uh, five yards there on the I can't wait here. to get that dynasty started, but I got a lot of unfinished business with this one. Now let's do a basic B back right. option. It's second down. That last play go. you saw was a Ball trap play. A little pulling guard yeah, action. Stack the line of let's just run some clock. Yeah, in the triple shoot offense, you're going to see just a lot of triple option. And a lot of choice, a lot of go. Ooh, that's just good defense right there. Went right by my center. Third and seven. And might as well go here. Try to pick up the first. Going man. See if I could just 
either give to my go or to my comeback. The Golden Knights come out showing three He's wide. Coming that way, I guess it's cover one with a strong safety. Throw Good throw by Martindale. Picked up the first. Brings him down. First and ten. Now let's run some run and shoot here. Let's go with wide receiver under. It's first and ten. Going on zone point. nickel. Martindale with four wide receivers. Six man protection. So yeah, for those of you who want a triple option, and for those who want to run and shoot, well, you're going to see both. And you're gonna see a, just nothing but under center stuff. He'll throw on first roll out here. He rolls out to the right, chucks it deep down the right side. Good throw, little he goes bootleg. Down. Oh, that's a paid homage to the old I school run and shoot. Than thick and run there, coach. Well, I don't blame him. It's pretty common to see a run on first and second down. But this uh, let's stay here. Let's just go. Guessing. Let's run a go. First and second. Here to go in this zone. Is the play of this drive. Big dog. Nickel big defense. Dog. You can run a lot of the run and shoot concepts, a lot of it out of spread, gun spread, a lot out of flex bone slot. I'm here to tell you, a flex bone slot is an incredible formation. A lot of nasty stuff in that one. Martin uh, Day to the air on first down. Ah, threw it too far. Ball's incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he okay, misses, it's second and ten. And that's I'm something he's been here. working very hard with his coach on. I'm going to run a... Uh, Halfback direct. I'll keep right. it between the it's tackles down and to go. like I would yeah, normally run it. The going zone. Clock's not running, so. They come out with four wide out. There we go. That's what I wanted. Just go right between the center and the guard. Great blocking. Right here. So now let's go back to the flex mode. Let's just run basic triple. They're going man, so I'll just keep it with my quarterback. When performance matters the most. They're spreading out. I'm going to take the chance. Every time they spread out, regardless if it's man or zone, I think it's worth giving it to your B-back just in case you can find a crease and head up the gut. So also, if you see both safeties come up, that's another good reason to give it to your B-back. In that case, they just played really good defense. Let's go back and run triple. They're going zone. I'll just give it to my B back here. I'll go left this time. Run a little clock. There was the option. Oh, almost got the touchdown. And the fullback bust through for about. And normally, if I was in the triple shoot or the flex bone offense, I would go to the flex bone tight formation here. But since we don't have it in the playbook, we'll just go back to our ace normal and run our basic toss. We're going zone. I'll just run it to the right, I guess. The Golden Knights come out in a two tight end set. Run some clock. I guarantee you this. With the triple shoot or some combination thereof. I'll fumble. This ain't good. Okay. Uh, with a combination of the triple and the run and shoot, the offense is not boring whatsoever. Normally with a run and shoot, people would get bored running the same six, seven pass plays over and over again. With the flex bone, you may get bored running triple one out of three times a game. Or uh, running the same five or six concepts out of the same formation. Both of them are, have the same principles in terms of scheme or as far as formations go. But when you combine the two, it's, oh, it's it's incredible. Like I said, you'll never get bored. If you get tired of throwing, hey, let's run some triple. If you get tired of the triple, hey, let's just throw it deep. A lot of good stuff. Did they call a timeout? Come on. End of the court. There we go. So needless to say, I'm super excited to continue practicing all that. Uh, should be a fun dynasty with a fun offense. Louisiana Monroe, three. Okay, let's just go hmm, Thunder 2, Hulk 3. Let's do a fire 2, see what that does. Second and 3 coming up. Ball on the 13-yard line. The Indian come let's out showing 3 here. wide. Back up. I want to get encroachment. 
We better back up. Over the Not over. <laughs> Good catch. Should have got the first. That was a well designed play. First yep. ten. The execution there. Nice job of getting Let's the go first back to quarters out of three four. First and ten. Ball on the seventeen. Rebus is feeling it, and he wants the football. Still got the first hand. string in. Nelson on first down. Looks. Comes uh oh, oh here we go, Jackson. The other Jackson. Another interception. What a great interception. Jumped up and just snagged that thing. Look at this. Let's go spread and let's go. Let's go back to. Where's it at? Yeah, we'll do PA raid. Excellent field Going position man. to start the drive. The Golden Knights come out in the shotgun. I may just keep this. Wide open, yeah. And it's caught. He might have a chance. Ah, oh, touchdown. Well, at this point, these guys are just out there. Blitz, heavy, heavy blitz. So just go to your blitz beater. And nobody was on him. Wide open. Oh, say again, a lot of work done today. Oh, gosh, still four and a half minutes to go in the quarter. <laughs> I'm going to put up 80 points if I ain't careful. And he hits the PAT. I know I need to run the ball. But to go here in the I'm just Let's throwing go. plays out there and seeing what sticks. Louisiana Monroe, three. Nelson lined up to kick this one off. Well, it went after that freshman corner like I was supposed to, Mendoza. Had an incredible game with 140 yards and all that obviously is on the right side. So he made that corner go to work today. They didn't have a chance against me anyways, but still. Let's just run basic quarters. That's a good run there. Finally got their back up in. They're a terrible rushing team anyways, and I've still went like 40 yards less or given up 40 yards less than what they usually do. Let's go back to a fire two. This is the Let's kind of running here. back who can make you pay when he's in the zone. The snap goes to the back. Spins Good tackle. Field. No place to go that time. Uh, Jackson, the, the other Jackson. Nice job. Going, up all the gaps going the goal line, so let me just go four out of three, four. Right. Third and two. Bring everybody ball up. The, -yard line. the Indian line up in a goal line formation. We're going four linemen here with me coming up. Off the right side. Just right up the gut. Jackson brings yeah. down. Well, going up against hard. three, four, just yeah, hit the gaps hard. hard. Football player. Just he makes sense doing kind of so. On every single play. This impact tailback would love nothing more than to have the ball in his hands right now. Running trips. Going draw. Right up the gut. Good run. Hall with a takedown. The offensive line got a really good five wide. We'll just the quarters. Nine on the play. They come out in a five-wide set. Norwood, back to pass. He's looking. Down the middle. Oh, almost He's intercepted. He's lucky that pass fell. Got to catch that. To the All right, they're yep. going. Total coverage on that one. Sam, I'm afraid to go goal line there. Better. Let's let's do 40. Yeah, let's do my 44. The Cover one. Third let's down see if that makes a difference. Louisiana Monroe. Lines up in a goal line set. Up here in the gap. Wow, right up the gut. That's a good play. No, the ground game picks up another first down. Well, this really works another on the three side. wide. You can see the guys on defense right now just trying to catch again. their win. Once again, they had a chance to bring this drive to a halt, but were unable to do it. The offense really seems to be clicking right now. Just keep now. running quarters. Let them make a mistake here for too long. Always wide open. Always wide open again. That's a touchdown. Oh, what a – oh, great defense. Got a hand on it. Great defense. One thing I failed to mention, it just now occurred to me. I had to uh, bench Joel Mays. Or Joe Mays last week, because he was really struggling. 
But I didn't want to give up on him. So I let him start again, and he's worked just fine. Of course, he hasn't had seen a lot of action today. My strong safety. So hopefully he'll continue to work pretty hard. Otherwise, I may put in Wiltshire full-time. I think Mays just had a bad day. I think it was against Georgia. It might, no, it might have been Alabama. Intercept that. Good defense. Got a hand on it. It's what matters. So the coverage continues Going to punt. On let's get the ball back. Let's see if we can run up that clock. The coverage has looked impressive, but this quarterback certainly has not. He just can't seem to find his rhythm out there. Bentley punts it, and it's a good kick. McDowell takes fair catch that thing. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchdown. The end zone. Last drive ended with a touchdown. See what happens on this possession. Let's run basic triple. They'll start going drive, man. Twenty yard line. We'll just run to the right. And I kind of felt the pressure there, so I went down. ahead and tossed it. Picks up about five on the option to the yeah, let's go here. Let's run some smash and switch to go in dime. Ball on their own 25. I would normally run it here. Oh, yeah, let me just go ahead. Martin and has four receivers lined up here. Looks like that safety is going to be defending me there. I'll just run basic direct and find a crease up the gut. That's a bad snap. Bad, bad snap. Had to make do there. I was going to get destroyed. See the team that's winning is usually the team that's I'm going to go back and run direct again. Maybe they'll go dime on me. Yep, they're going dime zone. I'll take it. So I'll just go right up the gut. And run clock. This would be my staple play if I was running the pure run and shoot out of the gun. And just keep, I would have a big super bag, big 230 pound dude, fairly slow, and just let him bulldoze over everybody. Not a whole lot there. That was good penetration by the line. Not too much, but the key here is try to Let's go. Let's do deep attack. It's second down and nine to go. Choice. Ball right around midfield. In run and shoot terms. They're going man. I'll just keep the Golden Knight. Line up and four wide out. Yes, let's block with my running back, get six man protection. I'm going to bring McDowell over. Give him a little extra field to work with on the left. Let's keep running some clock. If both safeties come up, I may just hit deep. Back to nope, they're going to cover one. He's looking. He tosses it short. Oh. I try to lob it over his head, but just went enough. He did a good job of freeing up his hand from the blocker. Let's go back with some smash. They're going zone. This is the fifth play of this drive. Four wide. Back to pass. Looking. Going for the three. And there's no time in the pocket. Rolling out to the right side. Wide open. No. Oh, crap. And he went way up, and he's got the interception. McDowell, he was so wide open over the top, I just threw it way too hard, and Markdale threw it way too low. That was stupid. Should have just ran the ball. And the game continues on. I feel like I've been playing this game for two hours. Got too fancy there. Good throw. Oh, man, wow. he's going to make a play there. Got the first. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. They're going three wide, so let's go after that the quarterback if possible. The D-line shifts over. Ooh, I need to back up. He called off sides. Oh, I had three guys on him. <laughs> if I want to get him. If I wasn't going to get him, the other two was. Uh, let's go fire. No, I don't want to do fire two. Let's do the other one. Let's do crash two. It's just second down. Yeah, that the looks good. Come out in a shotgun. The Indian. Come out showing three wide. Yeah. Going off tackle. Ah, oh, crap. That's a good play. Just not fast enough. That should be the last play of the game. We'll see. Third and 11. Ball on the they may try to get one more. I don't think they, they can. The no, nope. too late. Finally, 70 to three. Nice tune up. Nobody got hurt. Hatchell got hurt, but it was just for the game. So he should be good to go against Auburn next week. 
We thank you kindly for taking part in NCAA. I'm gonna look at the team stats real quick, just see how many yards we put up. In this game, Central Florida, 70, Louisiana Monroe, three. Go here. 535. Yeah, second half, I didn't do a whole lot. I tried not to. Whew, all righty. Now let's see if we get some commitment, so please stick around. Maybe I can get all three of those guys to commit. That way I can just focus on the other two guys. Let's sim the week and hope for the best. See if I can get a couple quarterbacks that I can build around, at least one of them. Because I have a good feeling one of the two is going to be starting for me next year. Unless I find another big-time five-star quarterback in the offseason. I mean, that's possible. I mean, if there's a five-star number one player in the country who can throw it all over the field, really wants to come, it's kind of hard to turn down, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. The season's going by pretty smoothly. We'll check out the rest of the schedule, too. See, I'm 5-0. Oh. I know I got LSU at the end of the season. They're ranked. I think they're the only ranked team I got left. I could be wrong. We'll see what happens here. Taking its time. Both quarterbacks committed. All right. So one of the two is going to be my main dude next year, other than what I said previously about finding somebody else in the offseason. So that center is probably a soft verbal. So we'll check that out. Let's go to recruiting real quick and see. Uh, soft verbal. My guess he still has a visit to Florida State and a visit to Georgia, so... We'll see what he wants to do there. But I'll just try to pump as much points as I can in that, dude. So let's go 34 here and 33 and 33. I'll just go ahead and get this out of the way. Uh, he's not ready to commit. Okay, we got an official visit here. Kurt Smith, we'll just do Vanderbilt. And that's it, all right. Come on back. We'll play Auburn. Head down to the Plains, or head up to the Plains, I should say. They're 3-1. They're having a decent year. So we'll just see what happens. Come on back. I'll talk to you later, and have a happy Easter.